enough. And there it is. There it goes. The ice bucket bath on the back of Tommy Tuberville, who is soaked and doesn't care. Inside. All right, Seth Aggie joining us here just outside of Jones AT&T Stadium following the 49-14 domination of West Virginia. 500 yards for you, six touchdowns. We'll get to you in a second, but how big was this for the program? Uh, it was huge for the program. I think it was huge for our football team. Um, I think we uh, we finally realized how, how, how good we can be if, if all sides of the football go out there and play at a high level. I mean, it was good to see. I think it was encouraging, you know, for for all of us, and, and it was a, it's a good boost going into a, a, a tough stretch. And into the end zone, touchdown Red Raiders! On a personal note, after last week, uh, kind of uncharacteristic week for you, how good was it to get back and dominate the way you did and, and really I know you don't get into this, but completely outplay a Heisman Trophy candidate. You know, I don't, I don't really worry about all that stuff. But uh, you know, I think it, it, it's good for for my teammates to see me play uh, that way. And I think it, it's kind of a, uh, you know, a tribute to the entire offense. Um, those stats um, overall, just because you know, offensive line gave me a ton of time to throw the ball downfield. Our receivers won and caught the football, and our running backs ran ran the ball well. I mean, it was a huge, huge overall team victory. Fifty-three yards on the run by Sadell Foster mention overall team victory I mean I don't know if there was anyone outside of your locker room that was expecting the defense to shut down their offense the way that they did seven points for obviously the majority of the ball game just talk about watching them work as well uh, it was huge um, I'm blown away by their performance um, those guys have have continued to improve continue to work and continue to, to lead um, on that side of the football. I mean, it's just huge. It's huge for us as an offense. I mean, it gives us confidence. It gives us a boost knowing that, you know, we don't have to press at any time during the football game, um, and, and we're going to get the ball back. Um, it, it, it's, it's so much different than it was last year, um, and I think it's a, a shout-out to, to the new coaching staff and, and, and Coach Kaufman and those guys and then the leadership on that defensive side of the football. So um, they're doing a great job, and, and they're going to continue to get better just as, as, as we're going to continue to get better as an offense. You guys as a program have kind of been looking for that signature win at home. You certainly get it today. What is this? What kind of message do you send to the rest of the Big 12 with a victory like this afternoon? And we're a talented football team. Um, and if we play at a high level, we're going to be hard to beat. Uh, and uh, I think I think you know teams are going to have to respect our defense now because they've, they've they've done it on a big stage now. And uh, and we just need to continue to improve and, and get better um, during practice and, and, and game by game. The only time you got beat up tonight, rushing the field. Talk about that. How exciting was that to finally get to be a part of? That was that was so much fun. I've always wanted to be a part of that. So that was that was the highlight of my of my, my game right there. That was the, that was a good experience to have. That was the highlight of his night, but a guy with plenty of highlights. 500 yards, six touchdowns. Seth Deggie, appreciate it. Congratulations on a huge win.